Hello and welcome to Sebastian Plays This. I'm Sebastian and we're back with Farah, Ali, and Gear. We just got Gear. He just became our newest colonist and we're going to continue just kind of building up the colony a little bit, hopefully surviving every little raid that happens and probably uh, do a little bit of rearranging, like actually make things look a little bit nicer. I think. Maybe. We'll see. But we could actually do the high witch rolls. We have like all the rolls we can do now for our ideologian. And yeah, maybe we'll do a quest or something. I don't know. We'll see, but gear is close to having a breakdown, which is... Which is concerning that he's already to that point. That's not great. Well, he's complaining about the darkness, which... Meh, it'll get better. <clears throat> First thing we need to do is... We need more wood. However, we're pretty much out of wood. So actually, we're going to start making some stuff out of steel, I think. So last time I was saying that we were going to make Gears tiny house out of, uh, out of wood. But no, we're going to do it out of steel, actually, because we're just bad people, I guess, apparently. It's going to be ugly. It's going to be terrible. It's going to be kind of a waste of steel, but he will have a house. And really, that's all he really needs, right? And we also know how to make some more furniture, so we could actually make beds now if we had cloth. Um, or we could make yurts. That's kind of cool. But unfortunately, still no good beds. There's got to be you know, rustic furniture. Okay. Um, unfortunately, we still can't make real beds, which is a little disappointing, but, you know, what are you going to do? That's where he will sleep. Hopefully that's not extremely cold. Mm. No, he'll be fine. That's actually really warm. Yeah, he's going to be great. No worries. So one thing I want to do today is I think our food's pretty good for the most part, like we're going to be fine. But I do think we should create another uh, another growing zone, this time for cotton. Which is this one here. And we'll put it right across. Hopefully... No, I did not make that symmetrical. That's probably not going to bother anybody. No one's going to notice, I'm sure, that that's not symmetrical. No, buddy. It, not a big deal at all. No, no one's going to be irritated by that. Let alone me. That'd be weird if I were annoyed by it. That'd be nuts. Like, what a waste of, of materials just to make a growing zone a little bit bigger. Because it would bother only you guys and not me. What was I even rambling about? This? That's not even an issue. Oh my god, you're not supposed to be planting potatoes. It's supposed to be cotton. Cotton, 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 cotton. Excuse me. Cotton plant, there we go. Gear seems to sleep a lot. Is that normal? Is he... Will laziness make you sleep more? Um, global work speed minus 35%. That shouldn't be the issue. Hmm. Need warm clothes. Who the hell needs warm clothes? The cold season comes. Well, it's still summer, so we're pretty good on the clothes at the moment. Oh, Farah, thank you for, for doing that. I'm pre-recording a little bit, just like a few episodes, because I'm having a lot of fun and I just can't like stop myself from playing this. So I really, really like this setup. Uh, so I haven't been able to like read any comments because the first video hasn't come out yet. That'll come out tomorrow, which I'm really looking forward to seeing what you guys think. And, you know, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, do all the YouTube things. It is always really appreciated. And also, thank you for all the comments on the recent Skyrim video. It's nice to hear from people, one person in particular. I have to look up because the comment made me really happy. It was really, really nice. And that was uh, Reborn Waterfall. 
really like your comments on my like on my latest Skyrim video. That was really nice of you. All right, what are we doing here? Okay, everyone's just kind of doing their own thing for now. I have to do the dreaded thing. Which, you know, it's really not that bad, but also I feel like we all secretly kind of hate it. Ugh, we're going on to manual priorities. Which, at least this gives me a good idea what everyone's good at. Um, I think I'm going to have... Here's number one thing. It's going to be all the plant stuff. It's like his big thing. Tend the fields, cutting down the trees, all that. Hopefully impregnating one of the other people. Wait, what is drugs? Wait. Oh, I thought this was doing drugs. Okay. Completely different. Um, I'm gonna have... Feyre, how about you? No, you're pretty good for now. All right, I'm not gonna worry about too much. Wait, he actually bothers to... Like, dude, there's stuff here to do. It's no petty jobs to me. No, do it. Just do it. Or actually, you're doing the smart thing now by harvesting those. You know what? That's fair. That's fair. And this should get us a lot more of a harvest because he's actually good at doing things. Hmm. I mean, that'll definitely work out. How's our food situation going? Not great, but not terrible. Ooh. Reminds me, you gotta go in there and do another ice crystal. There we go. Gotta keep the fridge going, you know? Which I think every few days I should make a habit of going in there and actually adding another ice crystal just to keep the fridge going. Otherwise, I'm going to totally forget. Also, what a great spot for just meditating. That's so cool looking. I wonder if we we can replant this tree somewhere, but maybe I'll turn this into like a cool, like, like just a really neat zone or something. I don't know. I really like it as it is. Oh, friend sent me a message. All right, we, got, we have an eclipse going. Hopefully that doesn't last too long. That usually lasts about a day. But I have had it go a lot longer before. Hmm. I think the longest eclipse I've ever had was like... I think it took months. It was terrible. I basically turned to like a bunch of mole people. Which I really need her to not do this anymore because that is just not productive at the moment. Like, I like her researching, it's great, but also, we really don't need it right now. Arcane crafting would be good, though. Actually, would arcane craft... Yeah, actually, arcane crafting would be great, because then we could have uh, temperature regulation, which would be huge, and arcane weapons. Okay, never mind, that would be actually extremely useful. That would be actually so useful. I can't even, like, oversell that. We wouldn't have to do this every few days and take up or manage, so that'd be perfect. I think ideally, I'd have her just pretty much reserved for researching and uh, whenever we're raided, I think would be the big things I'd use her for. see what else we gotta do. We might use this at some point. I haven't ever used this before, but it might be... Actually, you know what? Scavenging for... That could be useful. Scavenge for armor. Cannot scavenge... Oh, you need a skill to actually do this. What if it was random loot? Would you be able to just do it then? Then you would be able to. Interesting. I wonder what skill... Oh, it's intellectual. Okay, so we need someone really smart to do, like, the dungeon dives. Hmm. Oh, God, you just got hit by lightning, didn't you? God, the world does not want you to be... 
Not like you, does it? Does it, Gear? Oh my god, he's on the ground. Alley. Not beating. Where the fuck are you? Take care of this. Oh my god. I swear to god, if we lose gear, like, immediately. Okay, he didn't lose anything, but. Poor guy, literally. Alley, can you. Thank you. And maybe also just tend to him. <sighs> it's fine. What are these? What the hell are these? Oh, fireflies. Oh, that's kind of cool. I've never actually seen fireflies in Emerald before. Hmm. Weird situation. I can't believe you got hit by lightning to... Any chance that happened to, like, magically make you... No, you're still psychically deaf. You still suck. Okay, got it. Got it. God, you really are just... Horrible. Hmm. Oh, but she's leveling up in that. That's good. Ideally, they'd be working on this stupid thing. But nobody is for some reason. I don't know why. Meteorite silver ore. Ooh. That would actually be of great use. I have to pick that up at some point soon. Why are we not doing this, by the way? Okay, good. They will do it now. It's like, I really need cotton to make some clothes. Because otherwise, in the winter, we're going to be kind of, well, just completely screwed. So how are we doing here? Why is that going up slowly? I wonder if we have a passive research or something going on. Hmm. Which, to be honest, I'm fine. <laughs> I'm not against it. I kind of figure research will be something on the back burner. And because our characters age so quickly, it kind of makes sense. Like, we could consider this just being... Just us learning about the technology through different people. Maybe these innovations are happening naturally elsewhere. I kind of like the idea of just tech progressing very slowly in the background. Because we don't really have to be the main innovators to benefit from it. Which, real quick, I'm going to do the tilled soil while I'm still thinking about it. Going to do that for all of that. I wonder why we couldn't do tilled soil there. Is that just good soil? Oh, because it's lichen-covered soil, so it's better. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, she's going to till the soil, which I wonder what this is going to look like. It's going to look different, which... Okay, it does actually look kind of cool. Hmm. So that brings up fertility to 140%. That's great. Okay, that's actually really nice. So lichen covered only goes up to 100%. So this there's just going to be a whole area that just grows way faster. Hmm. Okay, that's kind of good. There's a lot of rich soil down here, which would be kind of nice to make use of. Hmm. I wonder, do we happen to have the mod for fishing? No, we do not. Okay. I'm assuming there must be a reason for it. I can't imagine Mr. Sam Streamer wouldn't, like, include it without good reason. Oh, did Gear try to... Allie tried to chat up Freya. Freya did not agree to the hookup. Well, that's interesting. They are both straight. I didn't know that they would actually fight with each other if they weren't of the same orientation. Hmm. Oh, this actually kind of just pointed out to me that we really need lights here. What is this? A torch column? That's kind of cool. Can we make out a steel? Can't. What are they doing? Hmm. 
I kind of like that they all like to go on walks together. That's kind of cool. This is a huge colossal waste of steel. Like, I wouldn't recommend doing this normally, but... I want cool things, so I'm gonna just put those in anyways. And realistically, at some point, we could probably get a stone cutting table and turn all the slate into, like, slate pathways or something. Which, that kind of works great because it's like a black stone. Kind of fit there were a bunch of witches. Oh, wait, do we need coal for this? Oh. Didn't realize we'd need coal for these. Hmm. Can we make it out of anything else? Our... Okay, it can be wood. We just don't really have any wood for that. Well... I'm sure it'll be fine. We use all our wood for this. Anything to look cool. When I play on my own, I actually quite often don't bother with... um refueling like I'll use a mod that gets re re refueling mostly because it just kind of makes the game run a little bit better because the game isn't constantly checking every single second to see if they're going or not which oh looks like that's looks like we have that mod here too hmm. so you just need to refuel everything initially that's kind of cool What did Gear ask? I saw a blue heart. Asked to hang out with Freya. Hmm. It's kind of cool to hang out together. Oh, he's got like no chance to hook up with either. What if she wanted to? Hmm. And she'd be able to. Still not that likely though. Esoteric studies, what is this? Uh, beginning studies of the occult, magical, and supernatural unlocks advanced research table. Hmm. Next in queue, arcane crafting. So did we unlock advanced research table? No, it doesn't look like it at all. I don't... Hmm. Weird. Writer's table would be useful, because then we could write books. An alchemy table would be good for making potions. Hmm. I'm going to put one in here, or at least plan to put one in here. Eventually, not like it's a big priority, but still have it just at the ready. Wow, they really, Allie and her really get along well. They're always hanging out. I really like how close they've kind of become. Like, that's really cool. Which I haven't decided if Allie is from the same place as Fairy yet. I kind of assume that she wouldn't be. Alright, this is growing at ice, 140%. Perfect. One big thing, though, is that we really need to get some wood. So let's just clear out all of this. Just an insane amount of wood. Which will last us, like, a day, more than likely. Damn, gear cuts them down so much faster. Or, well, maybe not. I guess Fair is doing fine. I guess she's fine at cutting down trees. And she's got a passion for it, so she does learn pretty quick. Maybe I'm just a little bit too worried about the wood situation. How are we doing on food? Eh, we're doing fine. We're slowly getting more food. We do have a lot of trees here, but like I am a little worried about eventually running out. 
like I know they will automatically kind of regrow and everything, but I'm still a little worried. Hmm. But maybe we'll do like a fiber corn crop or something. I don't know. Also, why are you on regular soil? Why 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 would you miss just specifically two spots? Hmm. Weird. But I noticed that she wants a magical place to rest. Ooh, two different hot springs. That's kinda cool. She wants two different spots. Oh no, no, sorry, God, why can I not speak? She wants a meditation spot, so let's give her one. A psychic soothe, that's awesome. That's actually great for everybody. Perfect. Such a good little colony. Gosh, really have all the wood we ever need. So, because of that, I think it'd be a good idea to make some storage for the wood. Timber that are stacked on a fish matter to save more space. Logs are stacked on a fish matter to save more space. I don't know if this is like actually more efficient. But we'll give that a try. I've actually never used these before, like, correctly. I actually am not sure how to use these correctly. Like, I don't know if just all wood goes into these, or if only 40 wood goes into these, because, like, stacks of 70. It's gotta be that. It's gotta be. It can't just be 40 wood. That'd be incredibly inefficient, right? I'm gonna set them all to critical. Eh. Oh my god. Excuse me. I like to click on the actual thing I want to click on. Oh, I was the whole time. Okay. And out of curiosity. Okay, it can't actually have those on it, so. Good to know. And then over here, get rid of wood. We won't have any wood here anymore. Ooh, more steel, though. Definitely will take that. Oh, more steel here, too. Huh. Insane amount of steel just laying around. A little weird. And a raid. And it's multiple people for once. I'm pretty confident that she's got this. I'm going to move up her desired mana level to be a little bit higher. Just because leaving it at that percentage is a little worrying. Okay, they're attacking immediately. Okay. Heading straight towards us. We're just going to go into like a big open area. Okay. Ice spike will be the first one we need to use. Yeah, I got you now. All right, um, Frost Ray has not been super useful. Well, it's been useful, but it's been too efficient. Okay. We got another ice spike in us, for sure. And that one's way over there. Ooh, 21. That would be actually pretty good to get, too. Baseline, where are their genetics? A cultist. Able to learn a cult sci path. Eh. Psycaster path. That would be good. And what about you? I should actually have looked. A druid. Innate Psylink. Oh, that would be excellent to get a hold of. Okay, well, I hope they don't die. Hmm. What are we going to do about this? 
I mean, breathe ice again. Okay, they're down. How are they doing, health-wise? Nine hours? Alley, go capture this one. We're gonna put another prisoner over here. Prisoners, there we go. Okay, and that one down there. Hopefully, it's a little easier than that one. What about Ice Breath? Okay. Then we get hit with another Ice Spike, and hopefully it won't die. Perfect. Okay, uh, that one's cutting it a lot closer. How are you in medical? The garbage. Okay, got it. Okay, you're gonna heal. Actually, can you heal this one? Actually, no. I want you to capture that one. You're going to capture this one. And hopefully they'll both live. God, it would be excellent to get both of these. <clears throat> they have two completely different things. You're dying in eight hours. You're dying in two hours. Allie, you need to take care of this one immediately. Two hours. Five hours. Okay. So it's not that bad. Twelve hours. Healed. Then she could tend to that one. Which has anyone lost anything? No one's lost anything. Perfect. And we got two more weapons. Pretty good news. Uh, gear. <coughs> oh my god. Excuse me. Gear, you are good at archery, but you're okay at melee, so you're gonna take this. <coughs> and Allie, when you're done, you're gonna take the one next to you. Perfect. And Arcane Crafting's done. Arcane Crafting's done? Alrighty, that was quick. Then we're gonna get Arcane Weapons. And... Okay. Then Arcane Temperature Regulation. And then Arcane Lighting and Defenses. We're gonna get all the magic stuff. Alright. <clears throat> you, we are going to convert you. You are also gonna get converted. Which shouldn't be too hard. Both the resistances are really low. Ah, uh, that's a little high, though. Well, these are definitely going to take some time. Male and female, though. That's great. They can be added to the breeding program. Who the hell is this? What the hell? What the hell is... What are you on? What is that? It's an assembler? I did not know people could ride those. Okay. What are you writing? What is that? A night ave. Okay, well, these people... Who, who are they? Do they have things worth trading? No, oh, they're just royal tribute collectors. Never mind. Awesome. All right. One thing we're going to do is we're just going to kind of start... Filling up this wall. And Alpaca's joined. How lovely. <clears throat> I'm gonna get rid of... Can I... No? Okay. I'm gonna cancel these ones and just do these ones. And then I'm gonna do a gate. Uh, yeah, just a regular gate. There we go. Actually, we can just replace these with gates, too, because I think they have more hit points. Yeah, that's 250 hit points versus... 140? How much do we get max? 160? Yeah, that's so much better. 
food binge gear. Mm, that's kind of not what I would like to happen. But eh, it's fine. It's not, it's not the worst. We still have a lot of food. So I'm not terribly worried that gear is binging. Would I rather he not be? Yeah. Am I a little bit irritated? Yeah. <clears throat> Going about converting these guys, by the way. Or... No, it doesn't look like we've even started. Fair is the best at persuasion. So it looks like that's all up to her. Ooh, that did not bring that down much at all. Ugh. Well, maybe I need to fix up the prisons. That might be a good idea. So for now, I think we're gonna do the storage. Which unfortunately looks like we can only do brick storage. So we're gonna do just a dumping stockpile over here. <clears throat> what the hell's this? It's just so oh man. That is humongous. Is that dangerous? Um, Just like rushing right towards us. That's probably fine, right? Okay, good. It is fine. It's cute, though. Huh. Would be cool if we get something like that, wouldn't it? Be awesome. All right, let's put that on critical. So then we can get rid of all the annoying things that we don't need. Yeah, I mostly just want blocks going here. Can we clear everything but blocks? There we go. And then we could actually make this area nice. Ideally. So let's add... Shrimp stock planks? No. I actually think we need to add bridges, I'm pretty sure. So where are the br bridges? There we go. Let's do that. Arcane weapons. Nice. And then we'll put in some floors. There we go. <clears throat> Normally, I like to make my prisons, like, completely, like, actually like a prison. But this, this will work fine for now. We'll make, like, a dedicated prison later. Oh, I guess it's gonna get too cold. Which is weird, isn't it? Oh, it's fall already? Oh, shit. And a raid. I kind of feel like I'm getting more of these than I should be. All right, fair time to get up. Got to deal with another raid. Ooh, they're like right there. I spike him immediately. You any good? You're Blake. What are you? Strong melee. Persuasion? Hmm. That intimidating presence? That's probably fine. Hmm. Did that say stored blubber? Huh. <clears throat> Ooh, you're so good at that. But we're already kind of starting to get... Ooh, you're good at healing, though. Hmm. And you're excellent at persuasion. Misandrist. Okay. Fast walker, sickly, straight, greedy. Uh, you'd be kind of annoying to have. You would be great, though. Psychically doles a little. Disappointing, though. Hmm. Well, let's see how this goes. Got that. Actually, then we need to use our 
ice on him as soon as he gets close. Ooh, they have range for once. That is not how that normally goes. Well, shit, that was the one I wanted, wasn't it? No, I wasn't. Okay, still have a chance. Okay. Damn it, I need to get him. So unfortunately, I need to move closer, which is not good because he does have a gun. If he hits us, he could just straight, straight out kill us. That's really close. Ice spike. Breathe ice. Shit, gotta get a little closer. That's not great. Okay, breathe ice. He's still up. Maybe not ice spike. He's still up. That's actually terrible. It's actually terrible. Um, honestly, I'm just going to put that right here just to obstruct his view. Okay. Just to buy me a little bit of time. And then Ice Spike, and hopefully it doesn't kill him. Sweet, it didn't kill him. Okay, he's got six hours. It's actually, okay, this is actually the best case scenario. Oh, uh, well, I guess the best case scenario would be we actually have the beds available, wouldn't it? That right next to there. And now we'll capture him. Which, where's the other guy? He was over here. Thing good? I'll take those components. And not really anything else I would take. <clears throat> you, however, I do want to take that off of him. Which I will absolutely do. So the gun is called Ragnarok. It's a full action rifle. It's not especially, like, really strong, but that could definitely go to gear. Because gear has 10 in archery. Which is huge. Like, he's actually great. If we get all of these, I think that would be the best thing for us. He really didn't get tended too well. Hmm. Birth sign the serpent. Hmm, okay. Prisoner, convert. Hopefully we can convert all these people. You're going berserk. God. Okay, we're just gonna, can we arrest? No, okay. Is he dead? Okay, he's not dead. Allie, you know what to do. We really need to get this stupid block out of the way. No storage space? What the hell do you mean, no storage space? Excuse me. I'm pretty sure we do, though. Um. Excuse me? Yeah, it's like, oh, we don't, oh, god damn it, we need to have all chunks enabled. That makes sense why we haven't been doing everything I've been wanting us to do. Okay, well, please haul it. Somebody has to. Ridiculous. Oh, my old enemy infection is here. And the one I want to keep alive. And I... Oh, it's because he hasn't been tended. Allie, what the fuck are you doing? Tend. Oh, and now she's sick too. Lovely. And that was only 18%, so that's... Not great. 
I would like both of these people. <laughs> so if we could just take care of both those issues. Okay, she'll definitely make it. Well, it's questionable. <laughs> um, it's gonna be cutting it close. Uh, actually, they might die. High chance they might die. You probably will then. Or, oh no, you're like right on it. It's right back and forth. Yikes, okay. 41% versus... Oh my god, it's so close. It's really, really close. I hate it when this happens. God. How... How could this be better? 49, 49. And 10 now. Are you tending? She is tending. 44%. That should be better. Um... I think it is. We got the temperature regulation. Um... Oh my god, this is gonna be... A okay, I think... Yeah, he's got this beat. You... Do not. This one worries me. Definitely lose this one, which... What were you good at, by the way? Oh, you're not good at anything. Well, why do I... Why do I want you? What, what are you... What are you good for? What, what's your deal? Oh, you just... Okay, well, if we're gonna lose anybody, this is, like... That's fine. And you... Damn it. Hmm. I would like them just because they have good passions and I could just stick them in a mine forever. Well, we'll see which way it goes. Not hold my breath on, like, anything miraculous, though. Just don't think that's gonna happen. At least this one's good. This is the one I care about. Because you... Why do I care about you again? Because you... What? Because you have... Why the fuck do I care about you? Are you you're unattractive. What? No, you're bad to like everything. What the hell? Oh, you're good at... Yeah, that's right. <laughs> good at animal handling and persuasion. Both those things would be helpful. He's fine. And this one's gonna die. Hmm. Okay, we'll get the two that we actually want. Oh my god, it's actually super cold. Oh, fuck. Okay, I actually didn't realize it was gonna be that cold. Okay. Yeah, colder. Ooh, hot crystal. If only we had citrine. But I don't think we can on this map with having literally no where to mine. I don't think we can get it. I have to wait for somebody to just come along and have it. But can build campfires. Even though I really don't want to. Campfire there. Campfire there. And he gets campfire too. We don't hate them, and we just know that the women are better. And you can have a fire. You can have a fire. Well, you can have a fire when you've earned a fire. Uh, the cotton is all dying of cold now. Because of course it would. And Jack is dying of that. And unfortunately, we can't just amputate the liver. So, yeah, they're dead. Well. Sucks to suck, I guess. 
Now we just need a place to put them. Just a somber. What the hell is this? Industries humanoid shaper. Uh, I'm not gonna pose for me resting spot. As you have people sleep or lay down wherever you like. Hmm. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, but I think. Do I not have any tombs? Oh, grave. There we go. Usually I use the mass grave mod, so this is feels a little wasteful. I think for those that die that were enemies, we're going to put them outside our north wall. I think that sends a good message. Like, don't mess with us, because, yeah, you'll wind up here. Oh, don't build that one. For love of God, don't build that one. Okay, we are burying them. Perfect. I mean, seriously, don't mess with us. We will bury you in front of our walls. Arcane lighting. We now know how to do arcane lighting. Next in queue is arcane defenses. Are we even studying this? Animal Migration Aura Siphles? What are these? Ooh, those are cool looking. Big moths? What the hell are these? Speed looking creature is only no example of plasma based life, life in the rim. Okay, well, they're very cool. Which I guess they'll probably just pass through. Major break risk from who? Gear, of course it'd be gear. Gear, dude, you would... I do need to get a gear a better room. I have been being a dick, not giving him a floor. Hmm. It's got, like, the warmest room ever, though. Um... Maybe for, like, temperature regulation, I should also give him a passive cooler. We'll be kind of fighting each other, I know, but it should just stick to the perfect temperature at that point. <clears throat> they should be good because it's warm here. It's only, it's considered awful, but oh, whatever. We're going to get rid of Melee's bed, and we're going to put Melee to a different bed. Also prioritize putting that in there. <clears throat> maybe eventually these will become like... I was already saying that these were going to become guards barracks. Maybe they will, maybe they won't. Maybe these will become the guards barracks. I think that would be kind of cool. Like the old prison turns into that. Kind of like that. I like the idea of it at least. God damn, are we never going to have anything harvest? Conversion. Yes! Got her. Okay. So she... Okay. So now we can recruit her. She's good at mining. So we can just put her in a mine forever. Which... I'm assuming Mr. Samus Jr. doesn't do this. Yeah, of course he doesn't use Minecraft. We're probably going to need to use Minecraft. So, I'll pick up that mod later. Because we have, like, no way to get resources. Like, we can use this. Kind of. Like, it's not great. We really need, like, really specific materials. Although, what could we get if we're looking here? Oh my god, that's a lot of work. Hmm. That is unfortunate. Because we really need, like, citrine. Maybe we'll have to go to, like, other places to mine. Which I'm not super against. Um, I want to say if we go to other places on the map, we'll be able to mine there. Hmm. Hunter lacks weapon. Oh, god, really? 
No, I really wouldn't consider a hunter. I mean, none of us are really hunters. We all just... What is this? Group of leviters, abandoned and lost, have wandered into the area. They seem to be custom... Wanted... What are they? Oh, they're cows. Honestly? I don't think it'd be a bad idea to get some cows. <clears throat> hmm. One thing I know is that if we get those... We get either of these, preferably the flame pylon. We could put them anywhere, and they heat up like they actually heat up the area, which would be great because then we could grow some crops to keep the cows alive like all winter. That'd be really good. Or she's nowhere near close to where we need her to be. I was thinking, because if we could do, like, an area fire shield, explosion, high blast, steam flames, meteor shower, fire tornado, fire beam. Never mind. I thought there would be a way for her to heat an area, like, kind of like how we're able to cool an area for a long amount of time. Doesn't look like it. Damn. Honestly, like, I know we didn't really build much, but I feel like we've been pretty productive. Like, fought off some raids. We've heat the houses. We should probably heat the kitchen as well. I feel like that makes sense. I feel like it doesn't make sense to have this area freezing cold. We don't need to keep this warm because now it's winter. Well, is that keeping up with things? No, it's still, like, extremely warm, but whatever. I wish I could keep these warm, though. Hmm. Okay, they're going down. Oh, how close are you going to get? Damn it. <laughs> so close. It's a low mood. What What do you have to be in a low mood about? Because serious pain? How are you in serious pain? Malnutrition. You shouldn't be malnutritioned at all. Hmm. Oh, no, oh, they're still hurt from the fight with Farah. Which I do like that everybody that joins the colony does wind up really loving Farah. Here's a real productive guy with... God, I swear, the moment I started recording again, he decided to get up like he's embarrassed to be lazy in front of all of you. Otherwise, he just, like, stares at the sun all day. Hmm. <clears throat> Maybe I should make other meditation spots for everybody. I think that'd be kind of cool. Mm, maybe not that one. Because we can't see that one. Yeah, okay. I made these spots for just everybody. Make this one be for Farah. Farah. Whatever the name is that I'll never decide on. That one can be for Ali. This one can be for Gear for now. Even though I'm pretty sure he's psychically dull. You no, know, he's psychically deaf, so like he really no point having him even meditate there, but who knows? Maybe one day he'll just wake up with magical abilities. Well that'd just be nice. I figure I should start fencing up this place. I actually put those cows in here before I completely forget about them. <clears throat> there we go. So fix six cows in here. That should be enough. Um, I'm a little worried that this place is going to start, like, becoming uninhabitable for everybody but us. I think that's actually super likely. Because we have enough food, not really to last the winter, realistically. We didn't really grow enough. So it could come real close this winter. Hmm. Can you tend that, please? Wait, why do you need to be tended? Old age minor. Oh, that's... Actually, you're going to be slaughtered. I don't think we're going to keep you. How old are you? You're fine. 
career to have... Dude, come on. There we go. And can I get somebody... You, you're fine at this, I think. Or are you fine at this? Are you good at cooking? No, you're ass at cooking. Okay. All right, we'll have a little bit of food. I really wish we were able to get more, more of those, but I think best case scenario is we're probably going to have to kill them. Otherwise, we're probably not going to make it through the winter. So actually, Allie, can you... Fine, here, can you just slaughter this one real quick? Oh, what is a frost thing? Ooh. Okay, you slaughter that. God, he is so slow. And then you don't consume. Don't relax socially either. I need you to butcher as well. Like, it's not well, it is a lot of meat, but it's also not a lot for the winter. Like, we have 408 raw meat seven simple meals and we have 63 survival meals uh i well we'll kind of have to see if we get through the winter or not this winter is in just two weeks so alpaca's given birth wait do we have a we have alpacas what excuse me no we have two alpacas Uh, well, honestly, I mean, we'll just, yeah, we'll take those in here as soon as we're able to. Major break risk. Okay, I didn't think so. Minor break risk from gear, of course. It's always gear. Oh, come on. Realistically, I don't need the cotton anymore, but. Can someone get alpaca one? You're building the fence, right? Okay, that should be like number one priority is finishing this damn fence. Okay, good. Then we'll bring a pack of two in. And we'll be all set. It's not a good farm, but... It... We could really luck out and find ourselves some rubies and be able to heat this place throughout the winter so then we don't have to worry about them just starving to death. But we'll have to see how that goes. Uh, I see that we're right around the end of recording time. So anyhow, thank you so much for watching. I really do appreciate it all. I really hope that you're enjoying the series so far. I love playing RimWorld, so I'm all about doing a lot of these. And, oh, look at that. We got a new recruit. Just in time. Perfect. And a binge party, which is... <laughs> These people have no idea that how close we are to starvation. Okay. Anyhow, be sure to like, comment, subscribe, all those things. I hope to see you in the next video. Until then, hope you have a good night. Bye.